I want to play some metal with this Epiphone SG Special Satin E1 that I rented. We're going to have three sound samples and three different tunings. Don't forget to look at the chapter markers and the description down below for more information. And before you ask, I'm using 10 to 46 gauge strings. Enough talking. Let's get after it.
So now that we've heard the three sound samples and the three different tunings, I do want to talk about the guitar just a little bit here uh, in case you are curious. So I do want to address um, 10 to 46 gauge strings, like I said at the start of the video, there's, I always get asked what gauge strings I'm using when I'm down tuning. I like having um, 10 to 46 gauge strings because I, I go through a whole bunch of tunings with the same guitar um, quite often. And 10 to 46 is what I use and I find it's really comfortable. Uh, I kind of can feel it a little more uh, when I'm playing and it allows me to dig in a little more. So that's the 10 to 46 gauge string thing. Tuning stability pretty good. It's honestly better than the Epiphone SG standard that I rented. And of course, I have to talk about the pickups here really quickly. They are a little on the hollow side. So you can EQ that out. That's not an issue. Um, but if you are, if this is like a second guitar or a backup guitar or anything like that, uh, if you're going from one guitar to the next, don't forget to readjust your EQ if the pickups uh, are better in the other guitar that you're using. So you kind of have to do that sometimes when you're, you know, you get two different guitars. And this is a good guitar. Um, I find that it's a little more solid than the Epiphone SG Standard. I'm gonna be doing a, a comparison between both of those guitars fairly shortly, uh, but uh, it's a little more solid, and I find that um, along with the, the satin finish to be, um, I don't know, quite pleasing for metal. So if this is your first guitar, or if it's your second guitar, or you're part of the guitar modding community, and you're gonna be, you know, swapping out the pickups, the bridge, the tuners, maybe even the potentiometers and the capacitor, uh, this is a great guitar. I think it's uh, fantastic, especially for the price. Um, now, if you were to increase the price, like a lot of companies are doing, I would, you know, uh, I would say maybe spend a little more money on something uh, with some uh, more solid tuners um, where, you know, you don't have to get that running start to actually get it to grab the string. But again, tuners, fairly cheap to replace for good ones. That's all I want to talk about here. Great guitar. Um, excellent for starters. Again, for a second guitar, great guitar as well. Uh, and, you know, part of the modding community, it feels like a Jackson, I have to say that, but uh, this is a great guitar. What the f is this thing?